Hello everybody, Steve Main here, getting ready to jump back into Oxenfree. Uh, we're getting ready to go through the electric fence and go and save Clarissa, who is with some radio tower, or with some radio equipment that might be able to get us off the island. Hopefully. Hooray! Alright, so we are going to... Eh. Well, that's not what I wanted, I wanted... So we're going to go to Epiphany Field. I want to head towards Milner Outpost. Yeah, let's go to Epiphany Field. So. Let's see what happens next. This is this has been an excellent game. I'm enjoying the hell out of the story. How are you, uh, doing? I'm fine, I guess. Why? Just checking, you know? Okay. How are you? Uh, could be better, but we'll get through this and on to bigger and better? Good talk. That's off to Fort Milner. Need to go find Clarissa and the radio equipment. Huh? What is that? Can anyone hear me? Anybody? Clarissa? Damn it, is, is this thing working? If anybody can hear me, I'm at Fort Milner in the, uh, I think, crap, I think in the gym or something? Well, she's around here somewhere. I was worried, honestly, that she, um, might have left. She sounded sort of scared. Like in dire straits, actual trouble right now scared? Look, I think we can all be included in whatever definition of trouble there is, so... It sounds like a storm is coming. Wren said something Fort about Milner was the home Fort of the Milner US being Army decommissioned, Radio Communication right? School, which but, saw more than and hear me out, students take it what if it isn't? What if they just said it was decommissioned, and there's like still people like in there like doing stuff nope decommissioned since 1974 they didn't have any use for a billion dollar defender of willamette valley go figure yeah but what if they just said it had been decommissioned since 1974 just what if all the stuff that's like happened to us the stuff we've been seeing is like the direct result of some government secret project like, what if there's some, um, experimental, uh, uh, program or something, and we've been catching, like, little slivers of it? Ah, uh, meant to hit a response there. Fort Milner was the home of the U.S. Army Radio Communication School, which saw more than 100,000 students take its curriculum. During the years it was open, the school trained troops from the various armed services in applied oral communication, radio and TV broadcasting, telecommunications, and what was then state-of-the-art techniques in code-breaking using an early form of computer technology. The school was moved to Fort Baxter in Southern California when the post closed in 1974, and it still resides there to this day. Fort Milner... Huh. Well, that may or may not be accurate. Let's see. Do I want to go in the door or do I want to look around a little bit? Let's look around a little bit more before I start opening things. Like, for example... What are these things over here? Spooky. Yeah. You ever fired a gun? No. Never really wanted to either. Why not? I mean, isn't that like a guy thing? Cowboys and gangsters? I can't ride a horse and banks make me nervous. I like football. I think that's enough. It's just my going premise right now, so... Photography prohibited. That is a very serious sign. Restricted. Keep out. And well, they're not messing around. Does the fine print say something about being... Yeah, that sign's old. Like, back when we were fighting Nazis old. Still, it's a little disconcerting. I'm gonna climb this... Well, let's climb up here and see if we can spy it. So, facilities are... Desert. I the red lights. Clarissa said she was in the gym. That light. For some reason, it reminds me of the cave. Okay. Two 
shooting something in here? It's starting to want to just... Ah, it's Morse code again! I'm really gonna learn Morse code. Something's going on. Dinner time! It's never too late to make dessert. Not anymore. <laughs> what the hell is this? Do you want to play a game? Uh, door right. open. I know the answer is no, but we kind of do have to find Clarissa, so let's just ignore the question and thank the weird radio man. Sure. Yeah. Oh, man, um. God, it opened a door for me. I don't know that I want to go that way. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me check this door back here. Which I'm now guessing is locked. But I want to make sure. Well, it must be locked and nothing happened. Alright, well, let's go try the creepy radio opened the door door. Because that can't help but go well. I'm kind of interested, though. There's clearly three signs, but I am only getting two of them. Dozen days of jazz. Uh, yeah, oh, facilities. Yeah, let's go to the facilities. Oh, man. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't be locked. Come on. Well, we didn't really need to go back anyway, right? Unless there's no way out, then yes, we might have. Well, Clarissa got in through some other door, so we should be fine, hypothetically speaking. Uh, speaking of which, she dated Michael? Is that right? It really wasn't. I mean, yeah, it was like for a few months, but you know, that's nine weeks in the scheme of things. I've had rashes that lasted longer. I mean, was he the type of guy that would go for that, like, sort of thing? I'm just trying to... What sort of thing? What do you mean? You know, like, intense, I guess is the word I'm trying to find. I mean, just from what I've heard of him, like that one story about the cops just straight buying him a beer? Just what would a guy like that see in her? Like, at least at the start. There must have been something, Look, right? Jonas. Girls go for assholes and guys go for psychos for the same stupid reason. They're interesting. For a while. But that crap gets old fast. Huh. Okay. It's just, uh, interesting, I guess, to me. Look, it really wasn't a big deal. That's all. I believe you, I believe you. Ah. <sighs> Can you imagine sleeping here? I'm trying not to. But why would the construction guys leave the bed frames? Seems kind of... I don't know... Kind of morbid. Yeah, it's... It's just strange to see it like this. Okay, that's the army RCS. I'm not gonna go that way. Clarissa is probably up this way. So. Hey, that's Clarissa! Clarissa, hold up! Was that Clarissa? Jonas, what happened? Are, are you all right? Jonas, let me in. I'm not in the mood. Great. I gotta find another way around. Is 
Something's going on here. Is it radio related? whole thing on blackouts I ask the Congress to prayer that since the unprovoked and dastardly attack by Japan on the Sunday, Pearl Harbor speech Day that will and Bugs Bunny. All right, there is more Bugs Bunny. Testing, testing. Um, okay. I can't I, I can't hear anything outside at all, but luckily this radio thing's working. Look, whatever. Clarissa's not in here and it's just a room, so like riddle me that, first of all, and then second of all, I can't get out. Uh yeah. Hold on. I'll check. I I can't hear anything outside at all, but Hello? Are you look, is someone there? When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. H how is this possible? W what's going on? Ow! I'm okay. Okay, what just happened? Cause that... that sucked. It's a... I guess a radio lock, so... The technology here has always been... It's like primitive and from the future. Yeah, no, it's something. That mirror is creepy as I'll get out. And apparently, from a conversation option I didn't take earlier, Jonas's mother is dead, so. Allowing him to talk to his mom is just going to be fun. So I've gone everywhere here except this way. Radio locks, can I use this? Getting the old radio broadcast is just creepy and weird. Alright, I guess I've hit everything I can here. Let's see if I can get out now. This is new. Oh, there's this door here I might be able to get through now. But I couldn't before. Yeah. 
it's not letting me go that way either. Where am I? Okay, I need to get to the RCS, but how do I get to the RCS? Back in the room that Jonas came out of? <coughs> Excuse me. So. Yeah, it's not letting me get out there. I think I have to go back in the other room. There's a control panel in there. I'm just not super excited about the idea of getting locked in there. Padlock code 3418. It's on a list of. Huh. They call codes cookies. Is that slang or something? I don't know, but we got the combo, so great. Hey, did I. Did, did you see that? In. in the mirror? The reflection. It was weird. Uh, don't think I'm nuts or anything, but my reflection kind of gave me like fatherly advice that made absolutely no sense when you were. Seems all right now. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't anything. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. Yeah, I didn't see. Man, I should have been paying closer attention. Fortunately, I'm recording this. I can go back and look later. Awesome. the radio one last time. No, I don't think so. I think opening the door is what set that off. Oh, awesome! There's something behind me! There's always something behind you. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna hate to go out in that. So actually, um, before... all right, I'm going to pause here. Uh, thank you folks for joining me. I do hope you're enjoying the game so far. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Um, and uh, while you're down there, please like and subscribe. <laughs> Man, this is getting very fun and very intense. So you guys have a great day and I'll see you all next time.